Matt's rats! Matt's rats! Sorry. <laughs> Alright, Pixel. Hope you're working on that intro. I'm ready for it. <laughs> anyway, welcome to Matt's Rants. This is Matt Allgood. Today I'm going to be talking about fast food workers and employees and staff and all that. All that good crap. <laughs> so, fast food workers. And they're incompetent nature on a lot of them. Not all of them, but a lot of them. Okay, so today's rant is basically on the holidays and people working the holidays in fast food. I think the holidays must have been a really hard time for fast food people because the last three times I have went to a restaurant or a fast food restaurant through the drive-thru or otherwise, my order has been incorrect. I've gotten home. I went to Arby's today. I went to Carl's Jr. Well, I didn't go like consecutively. But I went to Arby's, I went to Carl's Jr., and I went to McDonald's. And the last three times, last three places that I went to, they fucked up on my order. And today I went to I went to Carl's Jr. and I was supposed to get they got the Mc, they got the spicy chicken right, not the McChicken. They got the McChicken right. <laughs> they they got this okay. They got the they got the spicy chicken right. But then whenever I whenever I open up my wrapper to my other one, I have a double a double. Uh, burger instead of a single on both of them. I'm, and I thought the wrapping was a little thick. I'm like, why is this so, why is this wrapped so big? And I open it up and, and it's freaking like, there's no, uh, like it, it's totally like not what I ordered. I mean, I wanted a single patty. It's a double patty. And then I went to McDonald's like a couple days ago, like two or three days ago. And I ordered like a Oh, what did I get? I ordered like a, a McDouble, a, one McDouble, one McChicken, and like a fry and a, and a small fry. Because sometimes I give fries to my rats. They like treats every once in a while. So I get home. I've got like two McDoubles <laughs> and like two McChickens. So I was like, what in the hell? And then Arby's, like just probably like three or four days ago, I go to Arby's and I get home and I've got like... I want, I, 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 they had like a special, like a two for five, like a, a roast beef and bacon and then some other kind of sandwich that I got. So I got one of each of those, uh, the roast beef and bacon. And then I got like a, oh, what was it? Like a, uh, it was another kind of roast beef. I can't remember what kind roast beef and cheddar or something like that. So I get home and I've got two of each of those as well. I guess I shouldn't be complaining because I'm getting extra food, but it is, it is extra food that I didn't pay, that I paid for. It wasn't, it wasn't like it was free or whatever they threw it went in for extra then i probably wouldn't say anything but i'm like what am i just not making myself clearer through the drive through are people like mishearing what i'm saying am i not clear enough are they are they thinking they're hearing something else that i'm saying or that i'm ordering more food or i don't know i think people through the fast food thing had a rough holiday and they're just like they're they're like oh you ordered that and they're not paying attention or something i don't know i mean i think some of them are but this has happened like three times in a row almost, guys, and maybe not like, like I, like I said, I don't need fast food every day, but every once in a while I do. This is three places, guys. Three places that I went that they fucked up on my order. And it's not just, like I said, it's not just one thing. I gotta, I gotta shoot this. Get away from my food. Get away from my damn food. But let me show you. I'll show you guys what I mean. And I'm not gonna show the packaging because I don't want Carl's Jr. to freaking sue my ass. But this is, this is what I'm talking about. And I'll show you. I'll show you exactly what I mean. Let me move this back just, just a little bit. Okay. This is oh shit. That that tomato fell on the floor. I'll have to pick that up in a minute. This is obviously a double patty burger, guys, as you can tell, and it's got lettuce, tomato, onion, and mayo on it. So you can obviously see, and I'll even do it from the side. That is two patties. One patty of cheese, one patty of meat, and. Then the veggies. Let me pick this tomato up and actually take it in the kitchen in a minute. One thing I don't like about Carl's Jr. though, they have massive freaking tomatoes. They can't, nobody can cut normal sized tomatoes anymore. Have you guys noticed that? Like on most fast food places, if you order like a burger that does have tomatoes or whatever on it, none of them can cook like regular, cut like regular sized tomatoes. They have to cut like a giant increment. I'm like, I like tomatoes, but do I have to have such a a giant freaking piece of tomato. I mean, give me a normal sliver of a tomato and I'll eat it. 
But this is huge, guys. This is like a, the brunt of the tomato. This is like the, the back end of the tomato, like the, like the end piece almost. Maybe not the end piece, because the end piece is like the flat, you know, thin piece, or the, you know, the rounded piece. But this is almost the end piece, guys. So, it's a little weird. And it's also a little weird that they can't freaking, like... I'm going to cut this up for my rats, because, like I said, they like vegetables and stuff sometimes. But, like, am I not making myself... Am I, I mean, what am I doing, guys? Am I not, that, am I not making myself clear? Or are they just... Is there, like... Microphone system, like speaker system fucked up, and they think I'm saying something else. I don't know if it's my fault or their fault, but I'm thinking it's their fault because I've done this three times, and three separate times I've had this problem. So I'm like, I'm not like super pissed, but it, it's a little annoying whenever I get home and I, I don't have the food that I ordered. And plus I've ended up paying for the other food as well. So like I said, if it was like something free or whatever, I would mention it and say, hey, I didn't order this. But most of the time... I get home and I don't notice it until I get home, guys. I don't, you know, I guess I need to start checking my food like better whenever, <laughs> before I leave and go, all right, well, that's that. And But I don't always do that. I don't always have time to do that, guys. So it's a little weird. Um, like I said, I don't know if it's my fault or I don't know if they're just not paying attention, but it's kind of annoying. I guess I'm just going to have to make sure, I'm going to have to have them maybe repeat it back to me or whatever. But anyway, these are the pieces that I, uh, that I cut up from my from my rats, as you can as you can see, you can kind of see them there. I tried to I tried to air it down or angle it down a little bit, but they like they like vegetables and stuff. So I'm going to bring that into them, and, and I'll be right back. But it's like, you know, I, I, I don't think they're hearing me correctly. I, I know I'm saying what I want. I just don't think they're they're hearing me correctly. So it's a little annoying. Not like super irritating. I'm not like super pissed off or anything, guys. But I got a grease on there. I got to clean that off. But it's, it's a little annoying whenever you order something and then you get home and you find out, well, that's not what I ordered or that's not right or, you know. It's, it is a little annoying sometimes whenever you do order stuff and it's not, it's not what you ask for. So... I guess I'm just going to have to start repeating the order and say, okay, what did I get? I, I only got that, that, and that. Or have them repeat it back to me, maybe. Um, and that way I'll know that I'm not getting overcharged for something or whatever. But but anyway, this has been Matt's Rants, fast food, fast food uh, workers and employees. And again, I'm not bashing all fast food employees or whatever. This has just happened to me more, and normally it doesn't, this doesn't, it's, this hasn't happened this frequently. I normally get like, you know, you know, they fuck up or whatever and I kind of overlook it. But this has been like almost three consecutive times. So <laughs> I'm going to have to figure out a new system to order food. Either have them repeat it back to me or something and make sure that I'm getting what I want. Because I don't want to be ripped off or whatever whenever I get home and my food's not, you know. My food's not what I, you know, what I, what it should be or whatever. So but anyway, this is Matt's Rants, fast food workers and employees. And again... These, these are just my humble opinions, guys, what I think about certain things. You know, your opinions are going to totally differ on what you think about certain things. This is, this is just my thoughts or whatever. I'm not, like, bashing a certain type of thing or whatever. This is just for entertainment. It's just a satire, bro, <laughs> as they say. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe. If you guys are new, new to my channel, um, make sure you subscribe for more videos and stuff. I try to upload every every day or every other day. Um, I've been uploading a lot lately and I'm also going to start streaming a little bit more. So if you guys are interested, you'll, you can check out my, my live streams on Google Hangouts. I do live stream occasionally. So, but anyway, you guys have a good day. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like, like subscribe or, and leave a comment down below if you did like this video and we'll have more videos coming up soon. Thank you guys.